everyone, it's Lena Howland reporting for ABC 10. I'm here today in Modesto. We are tracking another protest. This is the first protest we've seen in Modesto since the death of George Floyd. We are seeing quite a few protesters march down McHenry Avenue. This is a protest that actually started uh, about three hours ago at 11 this morning, and it started in downtown Modesto. Now, the, for those of you that are familiar with this area here in town, um, the protesters marched all the way from Mode all the way from downtown Modesto onto McHenry Avenue. Now that crowd of protesters, they're coming up right behind me here. If you can see that, um, we'll give you a closer look as they walk by us. My photographer Rory and I, we are from a very safe dif distance at this moment. Um, the protesters have essentially shut down McHenry Avenue, and I'm gonna I'm gonna just show you my perspective. So the protesters are directly about one block from us right there. Police are on both sides of this just to safely block off the roads. Now I was on the back side of this protest earlier today driving around trying to find a safe spot with my photographer Rory. And we did see a very heavy police presence both at the front of this and on the back side of this just escorting them through the city. Uh, we saw multiple police cars and we also saw police officers on horses. Um, the protesters that we've seen so far are... Peaceful? <laughs> yes, they have been very peaceful. Everyone has been extremely peaceful. Uh, we stopped by and talked to a group of protesters that were running a respite. Uh, center where they have uh, set up a center of uh, bottled water, of food, of snacks, anyone just needing a break from the heat and the crowds. That's deeper into downtown Modesto, but we talked to some of those protesters about why they were out here today, and they said that they are seeking justice for George Floyd, but they are also hoping things remain extremely peaceful for the city of Modesto after seeing things escalate in cities like Sacramento like we did last night as we saw some looting in the Doco and downtown Sacramento area. So for those of you now tuning into our Facebook Live, what you are looking at, you are looking at uh, a long line of protesters marching down McHenry Avenue. Police have helped shut down McHenry Avenue as protesters peacefully make their way down this area. You're going to see some private security drive by me right now. And you'll start to see and hear some of their chants in a few minutes as they get a little bit closer. Welcome to Modesto. <laughs> A lot of police. And this is the crowd of protesters that are completely blocking McHenry Avenue at this moment as they march seeking justice for George Floyd. As you are well aware, he was killed by police earlier in the week. And this is the crowd of protesters that we have been expecting. And we are seeing Modesto police and other law enforcement agencies drive by us right now. And I'm gonna stop talking just so you can hear their voices and not mine. And I do apologize for any language that you're hearing right now. Obviously this is a live and very fluid situation. Shout out, Black Lives Matter! 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 Sh
shot at Dog Lives Matter. Yeah. They're blocking the shot. Welcome to Modesto. <laughs> Thank you. right here this is what I was talking about how protesters are peacefully surrounded by police um, both in vehicles on motorcycles on bicycles and on their horses right behind us here this has been a very extremely peaceful protest um, we're just hearing chants chants saying say his name and chants saying I can't breathe these are people calling for justice after the death of George Floyd And here are some of the police officers on horses working to catch on up to the protesters. So that's kind of the extent of the protest that we've been seeing as protesters continue to march down McHenry Avenue in Modesto. They're marching back to downtown, likely heading back to the Modesto Police Department. Uh, and we're also hearing... Sorry. It's a little loud over here. So, sorry about that. It is still extremely loud in here. Uh, and I'm sorry about any language that you're hearing on this right now. We're hearing uh, quite, quite a few protesters dropping some F-bombs. <laughs> At our, at our photojournalist, Rory, right behind us here. Anyways, that's just a quick taste of what we are seeing at the peaceful protest here in Modesto. They are just marching down McHenry Avenue, heading back to the Modesto Police Department. If you guys follow my Facebook page, you'll see that. You'll see Modesto Police, they have taken precautions in order to protect 
their police department, they put up some concrete barriers blocking the entrance of the police department. If you guys can still hear me, I'll repeat that part. Modesto police put up concrete barriers outside of their police department, and they also wrapped up the police officers' fallen officers' memorial right outside in order to protect it from any kind of vandalism. This is one last look. This is what we're seeing. We're seeing a lot of protesters in their vehicles as well, people standing up with boards, with signs. So that's kind of the extent of what we're seeing here in Tracy. I mean, we're here in Modesto, not Tracy. My photographer Rory and I, we are actually about to go pack up and head over to Tracy right now where we are hearing of another protest that is starting in the city of Tracy at three o'clock. So we're gonna go over there, capture that, check it out, see what's going on. I will bring you those visuals on my Facebook page here at Lena Howland, on my Twitter, and on air at ABC 10. So that's it for now. I'm Lena Howland reporting in Modesto. We'll see you over in Tracy next.